Let's put on some music. Alright. Hey, yo, everybody, and welcome to another quick play. And today we are going to play some Mega Man X. And we're going to, uh, well, as you noticed, it's a little bit different today. And the reason for that is I don't want to play it on consoles on uh, PS4 or Switch because the Legacy Collection has a lot of. And I mean a lot of input delay. So we're playing it on my laptop with a good old Super Nintendo controller. What better way to play Mega Man X? And uh, also it's uh, black and white because originally I, I was just messing around and I uh, hooked up my camera to my new laptop and I was just messing around with some settings and uh, I forgot to undo the settings. But, I don't really feel like changing it back right now, so we're just gonna go with it. It's black and white with a little bit of blue, uh, whatever. <laughs> so, but anyway, that's not important, that's not important. What's important is we rate the difficulty of this Mega Man X game. I just happen to feel like playing Mega Man X today. Mega Man X, rate the difficulty, let's go. Man. So, what do you guys think? Do you think Mega Man X is a difficult game, a difficult Mega Man game, or do you think it's one of the easier ones? Or do you think it's somewhere in between? Put it down in the comments. I'm curious to know what you think. I think, uh, I think it's actually pretty easy for the most part. But we will see, we will see. I think the hardest thing in the game, or at least the most annoying thing, is that spider boss. That guy's annoying. Oh! I wouldn't want to be you! See what I did there? Bam! 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 Bam, bam! Thank you, ma'am! Riding on cars. All right, bio time. Bio time in the city. Piece of scrap metal. Did you think you could defeat me? So, you know how that recently they came out with that, uh, or it was revealed or put online, a prototype version of this game, and they had like some never seen before scorpion looking boss. That was kind of, that was kind of interesting. And also in this stage, I had like enemies that shot down like flamethrowers that would like, like spread on the floor. It was really, uh, I kind of want to play that prototype. You have not reached your full potential yet, but if you use your abilities you are destined with, you might become stronger and you may become as powerful as me. I'll scout ahead and collect as much information as I can. I'll meet you and they will listen. I actually know you can do it. Okay. Show penguin time. Alright. <laughs> we gotta get them boots, right? So I'm just gonna play the game uh, in the order that I normally play it. And that means Chill Penguin. Everyone goes to Chill Penguin first, right? You gotta. You gotta get them boots. Oh. Alright. Take care of these bats.
Bam. All right, we got the boots. Oh yeah, ride armor time. And we can, uh, well, we can go up there, but not with this. And we don't have the fire ability yet. You know, these guys don't stand a snowball's chance in hell. Chill penguin time. Let's take care of this guy. It's pretty easy. Zero damage. We got shotgun ice. Storm Eagle time. As I said before in uh in his video, we're going where eagles dare. What am I doing? Being a complete idiot. Let's go get the, uh... The heart tank. There's a sub tank in this stage, too. That effect is so cool, right? Seeing that glass shattering effect back in the day. It's like hot damn. Hot damn. It always takes a little while to get through here. And we got it. Headpiece. I would like to do a boot only run sometime in this game. I've never done that. I've never done a boot only run. I've never done any weird runs in any Mega Man game. So that'd be fun for me. Apparently there's also something called a Kirby run where you use, uh, you have to use only the last special item that you got. Now, it doesn't work in every Mega Man game, because obviously there's uh, some bosses and bosses that have invulnerability sometimes. But I think Mega Man 11 is actually one of the games, when I looked at the damage chart, that you can actually do a Kirby run. There's a lot you could do in Mega Man 11, a lot of different kinds of runs that you could do in Mega Man 11. Should probably grab that health. I could have filled it up uh, into my tank. All right, Storm Eagle.
All right, enough messing around. No problem, no problem. I wasn't really taking him seriously. Bam, bam, and wham. All right, who do I normally go to after Storm Eagle? Storm Tornado. Some of these powers would be pretty cool for a figure. Uh, model kit, right? Flame Mammoth stage. That's where I usually go. Nope. Not the start button. Oh, it's icy. It's frozen over. Whoop. Nice try. Bad to goodbye. Take that, though. Alright. Ah, I really hate that. I don't like uh, how in Mega Man X games you get double tap to slide. It always messes me up. I wish I could disable that. Bam, bam, wham! Alright, we got the uh, chest armor, which will increase your capabilities. Oh, I'm an idiot. Yeah, you're right. Sting Chameleon is chest armor. Tank too. Excuse me, fellas. Ow. That was rude. Mammoth extinct. Woo. Whoop, 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 whoop. That ain't no thing but a chicken wing. Flame Mammoth. Usually, who do I go to after Flame Mammoth? You don't know. I should know. Um, I don't usually go to Boomer Coiner uh, right away, but I'm thinking, why not? I'm thinking, why not? Let's do it. A lot of people always wonder, uh, what is Boomer Coiner? I Googled it. Not gonna lie. But, uh, he's based off the Kuagata Beetle. Uh, some kind of a uh, Japanese stag beetle. Oh, you ass. You little shit.
Got it. Got through that. This is the best song in the game. Zipping through everything. Hot damn. You be the judge. Is it, uh. Is it that Mega Man X is too easy? Or is it because I played it 500 times? <laughs> you be the judge. Alright, let's get it. Let's get that. thing. Uh, so we haven't died so far. And, uh... We F9. Recording has started. Alright, so, uh... I was thinking, maybe we'll go to Launch Octopus next, or we can go to Spark Mandrel. Bam, bam, bam. Alright, Boomer. light dudes. Is there a mouse cursor on my screen? Let's get rid of that. Ow. He's a big boy. Ow. first. got any health, so I'm gonna use this weapon. He didn't give up. Oh, 
Come on. There you go. Yeah, when I had no health, I was gonna just do the uh, ice trick where you, you basically can't move. I got electric spark. Not the sparkles. And that means we're going to Armadillo. Bam, bam, bam. Might as well fill up our tanks. This is the place to do it. Sometimes I can't get my dash to come out. All right, let's go. Sparks. Ow. done. Bam. Armadillo. Who do we got left? We got a uh, launch octopus and sting chameleon. All right. Thank you. Shit. Oh, I don't want that. Damn. I 
I'll take that. Octopus time. I thought you, I thought you can cut off his tentacles. And you, oh, there you go. Yeah, that's what I wanted. He's probably one of the more difficult boss. I think he's the difficult, the most difficult boss of the eight Mavericks in this game. I mean, it's not that hard, but. I find it's best to actually stay. Don't get on the walls. Stay on the ground. Otherwise, he will kind of mess you up with missiles galore. He'll just keep shooting shit at you. Or it's better to have him do that uh, tornado and stuff. The whirlpool. All right, we only got one more. We got Sting Chameleon. Let's just go. Let's go get our armor completed. Man, we're really uh, we're zipping by. We're just gonna go right through this game, which is cool because I really want to get to X2. I really I haven't played X2 in a while actually, and I really want to play X2 again. So, it's a big green dude. sink the camera in like three minutes can we uh can we zip by stink chameleon stage let's go for it I have to resync the camera. Let's go. Bam. Ah. Oh, oh, screw you. Can't stop me. All right. All right, stink chameleon. You're going down. zipped through the eight mavericks now we just take down sequence fortress and we're home free and then now finally we found sequence fortress let's go in and put an end to his war against the humans all right Ba -ba -ba. 
We're going right into it. We're going to Sigma. Let's split up. I'll go first. I like to use the tornado on these dudes. Get some protection. Hmm. Stay back, X. Bow, 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 bow. Chugga, chugga, bow. Chugga, chugga, chugga. Ancient weapons are gonna whoop your ass. Yeah, I'm gonna let him hit me because that's gonna take a while if I pretend to be fighting him. Maybe. But I'm not through yet. best in the purple armor. I don't really like Vile in, uh, definitely don't like him in green. Too much like Boba Fett. I've taken too much damage. Ah, shit. Fun fact, if you don't pick up the buster, Zero will give you his. All right, let's get through here. Ow. Bam. No. Playing reckless. <laughs> All right, skip past these guys. Ow. Boomer Kawainer. Missiles all day.
All right, here we go. This is the most pain in the ass boss in the game. even on a charge shot. Ah. Oh, of course. Of course. Oh, come on. See what I mean? This boss sucks. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. Sub-tanks for this son of a bitch. Bitsy bitsy spider! I sucked my ass. Ah, oh, my god. Alright. Need another one. gonna take a couple of your uh, sub tanks the rest are pretty easy though I think the rest are pretty easy the Mavericks are easy Mavericks are a piece of cake ow don't be a butt Penguin. Let's blast him with some fire, huh? Alright, Penguin down again. And now, I don't remember who's next. business there. right along. Alright. Come on. 
Come on, you eyeballs. It's a really interesting boss that really definitely uses the uh, new wall mechanics pretty well. Take that one. Let's do the ice trick. said I'm going down. I don't think so. Bang. Alright. Did we do it? There's a couple more, right? Yeah, because there's still Flame Mammoth. Sub tank.
This one's a little tricky. It can be a little tricky. I had to use a sub tank. Welcome. I see you managed to get here by yourself. He wouldn't rob his pet of that pleasure. Alright. We gotta take down the dog. Sigma. Should uh, refill our health. Ow. All right, <laughs> that didn't go well. We need to not get shot by the lightning. Tank time. Oh, all right, sub tank. Now we just got to get in the final blow. Why have you done this to us? Hot damn. We really zipped through Mega Man X. Just went right through it. It honestly, uh, I mean, Sigma takes about, I mean, at least me, 
I use uh, all four e sub tanks. I keep I keep wanting to say E tanks. So yeah, we only had uh, one or two deaths. So it'll be on the screen, and uh, I did use a number of sub tanks. So unlike a uh, classic Mega Man, where I I'm kind of conservative with my E tank use, I do tend to use my sub tanks in Mega Man X. Uh, and we used how many? I used, I think, two on the spider boss. We used one on uh, the whatchamacallit that shoots big uh, energy balls. And I used four on Sigma like I uh, normally do. But we didn't have that many deaths. Almost none. If I didn't uh, do some stupid mistakes, we would have had no deaths. Mega Man X, pretty damn easy. What do you think? Do you think that it's just my experience playing Mega Man X 500 times over, or do you think it actually is an easy game? Because I think I'm gonna give it a three out of 10. So three out of 10 difficulty, what do you think? Easy, hard, or somewhere in between? Anyway, we will do some more Mega Man X, which I probably will play on my laptop. But next, I probably will go back and we will do some more of the classic series on the couch. So I want to do some uh, Mega Man 7, I want to do some Mega Man 5, I want to do some Mega Man 6, and yada yada yada. So, we will- and 8. And I want to do all of them, basically. So we will do those, and until next time. Oh, and, and I got a couple unboxing videos coming out soon. So I hope you look forward to that, and until then, Den Den, signing off. And you, as Mega Man X.